It's a very good morning from me, Neil Maurice, connecting with you on this Wednesday. It is now the 1st of May into a new month. I'll be giving you a free bet running at Wolverhampton. This is a horse I fully expect to convert today, trading at 7-4. to four. That name in just a moment. Well, I've put three extra bets out to my private clients this morning. Now, they combine the three of them to uh, combine into a treble if they all came in, which is worth 150 to 1. These horses are spread far and wide. One of them is running in Ireland, indeed. I think there's one at Ascot, but they are all over, dotted all over the country. These three horses can be yours for just £5. If you click the PayPal link below, my private client, Extra Bets Today, all three of them for just a fiver. Please take action because I think you'll have noticed yesterday we were on the ball again. Red Pixie, the horse that I gave you on this video, was the, I think the best backed horse of the day in from seven to one to five to two. Came there cruising in the end, finished third at Yarmouth, but it made no difference to us because we were on each way. So it was a winning investment. And L for Leather, well, winning gamely, I felt, at uh, Brighton, despite a drift across the track and surviving a steward's inquiry, but was the rightful winner and also plenty of money around for that one. So another winning day and a great end to April. Let's st start May in the same way that we mean to go on and look at uh, Paul Cole's runner, uh, Wolverhampton, Cervalo Della. Uh, that's, I've forgotten the third word, in fact, but this horse is certainly ready to win now after re reappearing at uh, Yarmouth the other day. And on that occasion, looked absolutely cooked two furlongs out, was in last place, but then suddenly the penny dropped and this filly just took off and in the end finished third. I think she was unlucky not to win, I really do. So you could say that this horse is a winner without a penalty. She's trading at seven to four today, so uh, plenty of people saw that and there's no uh, bargains and she's a short one by my standards, but I think she'll win guilt edge chance here for Paul Cole's filly at Wolverhampton to win. And until tomorrow at the same time, nine o'clock, this is Neil saying have a great day ahead.